What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video and I got a crazy theme to show you guys something that I didn't even think existed and it's it's pretty crazy let's go ahead and end the uh, screen safe there so let's just go into my device and you guys are gonna see what this theme is all about very quickly it's absolutely insane it's an animated theme so as you guys can see the app icons are animated and I think this looks seriously awesome. Um, I only downloaded it uh, just a little bit ago here, so I don't know if this is going to have much of a, you know, an impact on my battery. But I mean, I already have animated widgets in the background, and I'm running the 10s Max, so I've been having you know fine battery life with my device. It lasts the whole day, even with all these crazy tweaks running. But this theme is is just nutty it's crazy looking like check out these icons like how cool does Apollo look and Instagram and snapchat of course not everything is themed so hopefully the developer of this theme will update it to you know theme more icons but I'm pretty satisfied with what they have uh, uh, made so far I, I just didn't think an animated theme could exist or I've never even seen it and like I said I think this is really cool let's go into the crapple folder here with all these stock Apple applications as you guys can see here and they just have just a really cool look to them being animated you got the compass and notes the watch like it just it just looks really really cool this is almost enough for me to reset my home screen so all of these crapple apps are back out on the home screen just for the animations but um, I think that this is really really cool looking uh, in order to use it I do want to give you guys a bit of a disclaimer here um, I do have Anemone on my device. That's what I usually use for themes. Uh, if we go into Anemone, as you guys will see here, I have disabled all the themes. So if you have Anemone, uh, Anemone or Snowboard or something like that, make sure you disable all of the themes because th these will override the animated theme. So keep that in mind. You don't have to delete Anemone. You don't have to delete your uh, your theme library or anything like that. It's kind of its separate own thing. Uh, and I'll show you guys. Let's go in, into installer here. Uh, and the theme is called uh, Animatune Pro, as you guys can see there. Uh, and it does need this tweak here called Toonzy. So uh, you will have to install Toonzy first. I'll leave the repo for this down in the description. Like I said, you have to have this tweak. It's what runs the theme. And then here is Animatune Pro. Um, it is a pricey theme. I think it was $3. But in my opinion, 3 bucks. That's totally, it's totally worth it to have a crazy theme that is animated like this. I think it just looks absolutely awesome. So uh, that's basically how you get the, uh, the, the animated theme on your device. You will have to go into settings here. Let's go into the tweak section. And then you go into that tweak called the Toonzy. Uh, and then you have your theme section here. And you basically just drag it up and drop. Now, I don't know what this minimal Galaxy uh, 10s is. I I didn't try it. It came with Toonzy, so I'm I'm assuming it's probably another animated theme. But I think Animatune is just really really cool. I've never seen anything like this. Having animated um, app icons, I think it looks absolutely awesome. Uh, and that's me basically it for this video, guys. Just wanted to show you this crazy theme. Um, again, like I said, I'll leave all the package information you will need down in the description. For those of you that always ask me where you can get my wallpapers, they are available on my Telegram. I will leave the link for that in the description as well. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.